how is the group meshing as a, as a line? Are you guys still pretty solid in terms of getting bosses' calls and everybody doing yeah. what they're supposed to do? Yeah, I think uh, you know we're all great friends on the office line. That's a good thing about our group. Um, um, we all have confidence in Boss and the followers that he makes. So, um, you know, he's the leader. Everybody knows that. So, we listen to him, take the orders, and uh, so far it's, it's been going really well. Um, everybody's been meshing well, getting along, um, communicating well, um, on the same page. So, it's been all good so far. The uh, on, on the defensive front, um, they, they were throwing some stuff out there that I wasn't quite <laughs> familiar with today. Is that what you guys have even seen a lot of that? Yeah, we've been, we've been seeing some different stuff, especially as uh, camp has gone on and now um, these practices have gone on. They've been installing more and more. Um, some different things. So can't get into specifics probably, but right, they've, been, yeah. they've been definitely throwing some different stuff out there. Um, we've had to adjust and, uh, and learn what to do against that. I noticed in particular Jordan Jenkins looked like he was having a monster day today, and from what we've seen throughout camp as well, what, do you, what can you say about his camp so far? Yeah, I mean that's, that's been Jordan about every day. I know, I know y'all uh, y'all were out there today for it, but um, you know, Jordan's kind of turned it up a little a notch. Um, I, his dad was here at family, and I was telling his dad that his dad seemed pretty pleased, but. Uh, uh, something clicked, it seems, and you know, I've always known Jordan's had the talent. We've always gone to each other. Um, he's been a good player for us, but it, it almost seems like he's turned up another notch. Um, he's playing tough, uh, playing hard, uh, high energy every play. Um, he, he's a bear to block. Um, he's been doing really well. Another defensive defensive player we don't know much about at all is Davin Bellamy. He also looked like he was getting in the backfield, swatting a lot of balls down. Is he giving you guys fits in the offensive line as well? Yeah, I would say same thing with. Davin, as I said with Jordan, um, the kids matured a lot in the offseason than Davin has. Um, and, you know, he's really been playing hard um, this fall camp. I was telling uh, I was telling Jordan, actually, how I noticed how Davin has been playing a lot harder than in the spring in the past. And um, it, it shows. He's, I think he's putting on some weight. He's playing hard, um, getting a grasp of things. And um, he's really really been doing well for us. Now, have you prim primarily been at the left tackle position so far? Yeah, I've been, I haven't got right here in a while, so I haven't been at left. Gotcha. I also noticed uh, Brandon Coblano is getting a lot of time. You may have lined up with the front first team. I don't know if y'all were really showing first team or not, but yeah. what we saw, he was right up there with you guys. Is he, is he filling that role pretty well? Yeah, just about every rep that I've been getting on the left side, uh, Brandon's been right there next to the ones on the left guard, so he's been doing well over there. One more question about the offensive line. Uh, Isaiah Wynn, freshman, a lot of guys we've talked to just can't say enough good stuff about him and uh, really compete for some playing time out there, it looks like, this year. Is he, how, how's he gelling with you guys? Yeah, Isaiah's a great kid. We all love him. We've all got along well with him. Um, He's the type of kid that if he has a question, he'll ask it and make sure he gets answered. And uh, that's what you want in the offensive line. So um, he's really learned a lot and he's come along well. And, um, you know, he's a good player and he's going to be a good player and he should see some time this year. Yeah.